Hello and welcome to this webcast. In this uh, webcast, I will share you how to open Power BI Desktop and explore some navigation. So, Power BI Desktop can be open after installing on your machine. You find either from window recently added or from a desktop. If you are, uh, did not find a desktop link, you can create by right clicking here yeah, and drag on into desktop. So, When uh, Power BI desktop opens, you find this startup window. This startup window is quite handy and helpful. It provides a list of resources which can help you to explore more and become expert in Power BI. For example, uh, if you if we explore this window, you will you will be find uh, links for our videos provided by Microsoft itself. For example, currently it shows getting started with Power BI Desktop. Then it provides a video for building reports, query view concepts, uploading your reports, and create a full report. Then it provides a uh, what's new in current update. That update appeared for this month. What uh, what things are improved and what what is enhancement in Power BI Desktop. Then uh, it provides a link to forums where you can put uh, questions for your problems or if you are expert you can give answers to other people, other members uh, who are putting their questions on forum. And then it has link to Power BI blog where uh, latest uh, something about latest news and uh, are short articles and something like and then comes the tutorials here are links for our different tutorials provided by Microsoft itself for your learning uh, for example currently it shows get started with Power BI desktop download a sample watch our training videos all these tutorials links are available here and if you go below here is a checkbox that you want to open this window every startup then uh, you have to mark check mark here and if you did not want to see this window again when you open a desktop uh, power bi desktop then uncheck it I, I think it's a good link so i did not go to uncheck this and uh, left uh, left hand side we find two links that three links that get data if we, uh, if i click on this i will found a list of list of data sources from which i create connection to my report and then comes our recent sources this window shows me the list of all data sources which i recently used for my reports so after pop-up window or startup window i'm successfully opened the power bi desktop and it did not ask me to sign in because i already signed in you can see my name is at the top of the window uh, at the top right extreme right corner of the window uh, so i'm successfully logging into uh, this window uh, first of all when we open uh, power bi desktop first step is to get data uh, to connect with some data sources that option is appeared here and different data sources are available from which i want to connect and fetch data and if i have a uh, some in data sources in the previous windows that option is available here i can directly enter data i can edit query from here i will show you this option in more detail when i start creating my new windows uh, when creating my own reports in, a, in next couple of windows and we can refresh it and we can add new new page new visuals and these are options text boxes images shapes can be added into report designer this is a report designer uh, and if, uh, if we can also purchase visualization from a different uh, vendors uh, if you create your own you can also publish so uh, so currently some views if uh, and uh, we can all uh, it provides me a different uh, visualization options uh, which I put and something like that from a marketplace I can purchase uh, for my reports similarly you can load visualizations from file and we can also switch different themes for example in your window uh, in your environment uh, power via desktop solar and then you can see some changes 
uh, I am reverted back to a default and then this is the top window and uh, here are some options are available for a view uh, option in Power BI desktop uh, three options are available report uh, data and relationship uh, if we click on this you can see that this is a designer report that will be show here here is if I connected with a certain data uh, data source then data will be appear here and here is the relationship we can create relationship between different tables and designer we can get our, our own model here we can see you in detail in the next couple of videos if we go on a report designer here is a visualization and these uh, tabs can be uh, these pens can be hide and show uh, to create more space for a report so in for visualization we can create we can add stack uh, column column chart currently we have no data so it will be appear something like that we can also add maps based on uh, data we can also drag and drop uh, all these things and if we go on a view there are some uh, options that will be helpful for designing a report for example it shows the uh, grid lines so we can align different objects with respect to these grid lines and here we can also lock the uh, objects you can see I cannot drag further this object this view visualization object uh, uncheck and something like that these are some uh, options are available here and we can also see here how it uh, window look like on a mobile our power bi report will be look like on a mobile and we can switch back to report uh, we can switch back to desktop mode and similarly modeling we can add a new table new parameter if we, if we in a view in a report mode and when we switch to data you can see some options are disabled uh, all visualizations options are disabled or disappeared and these options are disappeared and we go on a relationship or in a model or range and all these things are gone uh, here when if we, ha we have a different table then this option provides us that we can add it or create or remove relationship between the different tables um, for uh, visualization that tables did not reflect on actual data source that that uh, relationship will be created added or removed on our model so if we go, if switch back to reports uh, if we go on a review uh, if we go on uh, data here here data window uh, then this you can see these options are also disabled but uh, data entering data yeah and queries all these options are available so uh, overview of uh, power bi desktop itself where you can design your report its navigations uh, data sources connections uh, visualizations each and everything thank you for watching see you in next video